In today's video, I'll be showing you how to fix not being able to hear your friends or other players within Call of Duty Warzone Pacific on your PC. So there's a few different reasons why you might be having this issue, but let's go ahead and jump straight in and see if we can resolve the problem. So the first thing you need to do is just ensure you have your speaker sound turned up. So within Windows, you need to go to the bottom right hand corner and click on the speaker icon. And you now need to ensure this is turned up to 100. And that also goes for your speakers. You need to ensure they are actually turned on and they are turned up. So go ahead and turn the volume up now on your speakers. And if this wasn't turned up, go ahead and turn this up as well. And if you have a sound file on your computer, go ahead and play that file and see if you can hear the song or whatever sound it is. If you can, then happy days, go ahead and jump into Warzone and see if that resolved the issue. If your sound was already turned up and that is not the issue, then the next thing you need to do is just ensure you have the correct output selected in Windows. So currently I have my BenQ monitor selected for the output, which means that the sound will come out of my monitor at the moment. However, if I click on the up arrow, you can see I have a few different options. So if I select speakers high definition audio device, that will now play the sound through my headphones. So ensure you do have the correct output selected that you want to hear your friends and other players on in Warzone. So once you've done all that, and if that wasn't the issue, the next thing you need to do is just ensure you have the latest driver installed for your sound card. I will pop a link in the description below to a video of me showing you how to update your driver if you have a Realtek audio device. If you don't, then you will need to head on over to the manufacturer website of your sound card or device and download the latest driver and install it. Once you've done that, restart Windows and see if that resolved the issue you're having. If it didn't, then the next thing we now need to do is go ahead and launch Warzone and we're going to take a look at a couple of the options within the game. Once you're in game, you now need to select options in the bottom left hand corner and you then need to go across to audio. You now need to ensure that your master volume is on 100 and you then need to scroll down until you come across speakers, headphones, game sound device and you need to select your sound device from this list. So at the moment, mine is on default system device. You need to select your device. So if I want to hear everyone through my BenQ monitor, then I would select my BenQ monitor. If I want to actually hear them through my headset, then I would need to select my speaker's high definition audio device. If you now scroll down a bit more, as you can see, my voice chat is disabled. You need to ensure that this is set to enabled. And you then need to change speakers, headphones and voice chat device. And you need to also change this to speakers high definition audio device for myself. You need to select your speakers. And you then need to scroll down a bit more. And you now need to ensure that the voice chat volume is set to 100. So that is it for the settings within the game. Once you've done all that, you now need to press the Windows key to go to your desktop. Once you're on your desktop with Warzone still running, you now need to go down to your system tray and right click on your speaker icon. You need to select open volume mixer and you need to ensure that Warzone is on 100. As you can see, mine is currently set to 100 and you also need to ensure there's no cross on the speaker icon. So once you've done all that, you should now be able to hear your friends and other players within Warzone. I hope this video did help you out and you enjoyed the video. If you did like the video, click the like button below. And if you want to see more computer sluggish videos, then hit that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.